Yes, you were right. It was rigged in your favor. Or bit, bitch and you will, you shall receive. That's what it is. Anyway, so you're rated. Take care of that. Let's see. We should go through one turn. And the memorial defense in one more turn, too. Oh, we already went off of this stuff. Tonight. I just didn't hit the next button or next turn button before I left. A little England. Oh, I sent them metal, didn't I? Let's find out and see how that goes. Here, the 53 authority. We need a lot more authority. So, new population here. This is a metal produce. We get producing, what, five metal here? Actually, six. It's at least five. Oh, our metal didn't go. I screwed up on using that metal as a gift, I think. Anywhere. Stud. So horses are what we need to make. We need horses. Single little nearby st structure would provide more. A single nearby structures would produce more expected base changes. Mm -hmm. Food one, money two, honest population of one. Let's produce some horses. 66 turns, though. How about three turns? For positive food, so we're good. That's that one. Over here, we built uh, manorial demands, so that's more food production. Of growth in six terms. Infrastructure at negative four, though, so we don't want that. I look now, it's at zero. Let's have a plus four. So I actually have some extra st uh, infrastructure. Yeah, it'll take us a little bit longer to grow, but that's okay. Which money do we lose? Eleven. Let's get more stewardship. I think this is what's causing our authority to go up, I think. I have some audio popping on from my mic or from the game. Because it might be the game. I'm sorry, wrong button there. Options. Let's see if I can hear it, maybe. Probably not. Audio popping? What kind of audio popping? So it's not my mic. Intermittent pop. But is it... But it's not doing it now, of course. But Ring's got a clip. Take a look at that later. Or listen. Yeah, I'm not hearing any popping. We 
but it's also harder for me to hear because I'm it's basically an, it's just a, an echo for me so it's kind of weird it's weird I have to I have to rely on recordings to catch that kind of stuff anyway over here so we built a Manorial Demence, again, which gets us food and some money, but it gets some, uh... Livestock imported from Dublin, costs that, produces reserve food. That's that. And here, picked up another population. Cattle ranch. We have so many cattle ranches. Medical practitioner. Health. Oh, produces money too. We seen a bonus of three from drugs and herbs and naphtha. It happened again. Mm, so long duration between pops. It happened again. Are we sure it's not that sound? Is it? Yeah, it's the game. <laughs> it's the game. <laughs> Open and closing the windows, that's the popping sound. <laughs> uh. <laughs> that's good. So now the question is, is that this? Yeah, that's, that's that sound effect. There. Hopefully you don't hear that so much now. I turned it down. <laughs> Remember the... Mood 3 GUI sounded as very loud. Yeah, sometimes they put these really loud noises into UIs, and I, I don't understand the need for that, other than I don't understand the need for that. <laughs> yeah, it's it's crazy. Yeah, it's... And I've been I've been hearing it, you know, playing the game and stuff. It's like, man, it's like I'm I don't need it. And I, I mean, I guess I, can, I don't know what other sound effects it turns off though by lowering the volume. The new laptop in the service today, and I never. <laughs> You'll be fine. Anyway, medical practitioner or a trader's borough. or a sunken opening. Change for victim level by two. It's temporary. Scry. Bremen, Cot Bremen Cot Cottages. Rocket says hello. I don't know if everybody heard that or not. Garrison. Sorry. This is Bremen College. Freeman Colleges. <laughs> He doesn't say Bork. He says, Arr. Okay, some freemen have come to dwell in this re region. They can work their land as they wish, provided they pay their taxes. So what does this give us? Gets us better health, reduces infrastructure, costs money, stewardships increase, manpowers increase. We should probably do this. It's only three turns. Wow, three turns and only one person working on it. Two... Two. Two is the lowest we're going. Fastest we're going. Take advantage of this uh, extra food production. Yes, rocket is not a G, uh, not a gooey sound. But I could make it a gooey sound. You know that's funny though. I could make it so that it was. Every time I hit a certain button or have Veronica res respond to certain words, that won't drive you crazy, would it? 
It might freak me out, though, because, you know, I'm already listening to him in real time, too. Anyway, so. Freeman Cottages. Cottages there. Population in eight turns. We're trying to build up our infrastructure, too. Up here, what's this? Peasants of a region, for once, are lucky. Their sterile lands are found to be rich in salt. Oh, that was the the, uh, the free random resource we just uh, enabled. So now we have salt and tin here. The bork button would definitely stress me out a lot. So, one turn for the farm. Okay. So, any other cool edicts we can do? Oh, I gotta get rid of all that extra metal. So, English. 25. Yeah, I screwed that up. Doing this before, I kind of messed that up. You have to answer your pending request. No other action possible. Oh. So they haven't eaten up the metal yet. Hmm. It's taking so long. I need to stop spending my money. I need to start saving. I have these guys let's have these guys do I'm gonna do a save. Test raid. So we're gonna have these guys go on a little raid. It should just raid them. Oh, wait a minute. They're not gonna be able to raid that stuff, are they? Or is that just their possible movement? They shouldn't be able to it's only me adjacent stuff here that should be able to raid. They better not be going up there because that'd be really lame. Guess we'll find out. Next turn. This is in turn. Well, that group we lost one. After the ruling of our realm is insufficient and incompetent advisors. Well, how do we fix that? Military reform. Improved skirmishers and light infantry units. Military reform. Improved skirmishers and light infantry units. With this decision, all skirmishers and light infantry units will be improved. You have several possible options, so choose wisely as to how you want to customize your military. Be aware that other reforms will appear later under some conditions, which will supersede your choice and thus allow you to change your strategy. A bonus of 100 legacy will also be granted to the reforming nation. It expires next turn. This condition can be activated. Infantry units. Oh, sorry. With this decision, all skirmishers and light infantry units will be improved. And you have several possible options to choose wisely. We just said that. Heavier javelins, defensive training, duty to bear arms, or raiders and marauders. So your skirmishers units will be equipped with slightly more powerful javelins and other missile weapons, giving them a plus one range attack. 65 gold. Defensive training, adopting practices from seasoned scouts and woodsmen while the music got loud. Your light infantry is trained in the art of invasive maneuvers and how to support each other, giving them plus one defense. Due to bear arms, citizens who can afford to equip themselves as light infantry are now required to own and maintain certain minimum items of arms and armor, and to make themselves ready when called to service by their lord. This decreases the money and metal needed to raise and maintain a unit and gives it some starting XP, but property classification imposes a cap that increases the management cost. No idea what that all means. 
Raiders and Marauders. Our light infantry units are now adept in raids and hit and run warfare taking place in difficult terrains, forest, hills, and mountains. Additional training in dangerous terrain will tend to increase manpower upkeep though. So javelins or defense? Plus one to range attack or more defense. Uh. No rocket. Let's see range attack. Okay. So sixty five gold. Vassals, no vassals, 28 peasants, 6 freemen, 4 clergy, 6 nobles, average loyalty 114, money stable. Lost 9% in 5 turns. Did I? Probably because of those mercenaries. Manpower stable. Gained 13% in 5 turns. Metal stable. Gained 11% in 5 turns. So we're not getting better stuff then. There's our decision. Or administrator, still. When do you get to get replaced? He's 52, any day now. Okay, the impudent clan of Munster, blah, 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 and my authority. Suffering some internal tensions. Blah, 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 has called for the immediate construction of village roads. <sighs> he received a new regional decision to recruit non standard units. Uh, is ready to buy. The defense easily repelled them. Felt the offer was not to the best of their interest and rejected it. So easily rep repelled us. So it's not these guys, it's everything here. Combat power 37 and 13 units. So we're going to suck up that manpower. That was harsh. Twenty-four power in this one. This is their raiding unit. So if he raids again, we'll crush him. I hope with our awesome thirty-seven. Of course, we could just move away, but let's just stay here. Well, so much for the raid. So now we know. Don't do that. <laughs> Not when there's that strong of a defense in their capital. Anyway, horses in two. Population 5. Do we build up here? Farm has been completed. And they were switched right over to village roads. Didn't even get a choice. It's okay. Oops. oops. You say oops quite often. You say oops quite do often. Do you need assistance? Do you need assistance? I do. As I turn that off an accident. Eh, we'll see what happens. If we, they might reinstate it. More people in three turns. But no extra infrastructure. That's just a good job. What happened to all my free men? Oh, Mr. Gimpy's home finally. Thought we had more free men here. Oh well. So, England. They rejected our. They didn't even take the medal from us. We really need to get rid of the metal. Galloway, you guys like us. Wales. So they're still independent, so. Cooperation for four percent. Give you lots of metal because we need to get rid of it. Twelve percent chance. Wow. What 
whatever, I guess. Hopefully they take that, because this metal is just overflowing. That's why it's red. Refuge, refuge stockpile. Free supply per turn 12. Duration 13. Is that there? Wow. So I get rid of this claim. Other than eliminating the troublemakers. Serfs, peasants, and I'll be rounded up and armed hastily. They can be used to soften up the enemy or guard the baggage train. More loyal legions will provide more troops, uh, but the population can be depleted. So don't do that. So the counselor. Nope. Okay, next turn. Wow, plus eight. How'd that happen? How did that go up by eight? What did I do? <laughs> Under the wise rule of Thomas, uh, it was progressing. Progress to your reach. Oh, I think we have a replacement. We have a new leader. That's why he went up so high. So, he's a good diplomat. This ruler is a decent diplomat. Often he will be able to come home with a good deal from uh, the negotiation table. Diplomacy bonus of 10% of current rate to the acceptance uh, chance of treaties. Diplomacy plus 5 rules per turn to improve foreign relationships. Progress token chance improved by 2%. Good administrator. This ruler is a decent administrator. He's able to restore efficiency in the state and people believe in him. Authority bonus plus 5%. Product productivity in agriculture jobs increased by 1. Productivity in infrastructure job increased by 1. Regional loyalty bonus 4. You are so much better than your father. I don't care about the poor military thing. I care about this stuff. He is so much better than his father. After the unexpected death of Godfrey, the populace, blah, blah, I've turned to Thomas to guide them. Oh, you're not married, though. Noble son of six. How old are you? You are 29. I need to get you a wife. How do you have a son but no wife? Who's your sister? How do we get you married off? I know we can marry off daughters and stuff, but how do you actually get married? Nightclub scene? Yes, the, the famous medieval Irish nightclub scene. He received a progress token and is now standing at zero progress tokens. <laughs> That's good. Monster found on Forge Dunham. Deceit is a violent act and grows the very fine recover authority. He received a new regional de decision. Fight the plague. Doesn't help me. While partaking in a royal hunt with his entourage, a feral beast claimed the life of Jot Godfrey. That's how he died. Saw an invasion by Munster, the local militia was beaten, and... What? Village concurrent? Wait a minute. So his awesome army of... Thirty-five power beat up on mine of fifty-two. I don't understand how that happens. Was you beaten? Some pillaging occurred. Suck. And they destroyed our bloomery. Ugh. Well, solves our metal production issue. Of course, now we have to build a new one after these horses are done. We have the equipment for the most part, right? Sort of. Wow. 
So this fortified village isn't very fortified. It's really annoying. I like how when I raid him, I get my ass kicked, but he raids me not so much now. Because, whatever. Okay. Growth in four turns. Yeah, we built uh, the Fremen, Fremen, Freeman colleges. Well, the way it works is when they do a raid, you have to fight every. They have to fight everything that's in here that's military. So garrisons and any armies that are sitting there. Which you would think he's raiding with this thing, with a combat power at thirty-five, going against what's in the garrison, which I know isn't very strong at eighteen. But this army is still 52, so we're at least twice as strong as him. How he got an actual pillage off, I don't know. Long live the fighters. I think that's actually what it means. Or that's the saying in Doom. Anyway. Growth on three. So we have the Freeman College Cottages. Where do they show up? Ah, oh, they're over here. So these guys. So money decreased. We have we have no money coming in actually. Stewardships of two, manpower at one. Some are a lot of money. Oh, because we lost that bloomery, I guess. It's hitting our metal income. You guys are going to have to put one of you over here to work on the money situation. We don't have any Freeman. Oh, we do have an extra one. Not a lot of extra money, but it's extra money. Dung cart. He's making a dung cart. Still want to know how he did a decent raid with Freaking 35 power army. So, Wales rejected our offer. Nobody wants our medal. My lord, Southern Mona has a decent population but a poor health system, thus increasing chances of an epidemic and slowing down growth considerably. Our military expertise is decreasing and our soldiers are lack training. We need to build more military structures. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we just finished uh, the stud stuff. So now we have horses. Uses horses. need to grow the population. No growth. Nine turns. Six turns. Seven turns. Let's have some stuff going in infrastructure. Three. Names have removed. Warfare claim has been removed as we had too many decisions. An unexpected twist of events, a cunning trader in our territory gained an advantage of 10 resources. That's good, I guess. So, growth in two. Stockpiling just a little bit of infrastructure.
keep some food coming in. Which is our meow? 35 power to R72. So if he crosses that line to raid us again, we should just kick his ass, right? That's the way it's supposed to work. We can actually recruit another unit. What can we recruit these days? Still no cavalry. We have horses, but no cavalry yet. I think we have to have... And I think there's a military building you have to build, too. Wow, we got no... Why do the donkeys always have to suffer? Because they're asses. No? I don't know what the numbers is. I hit something here to turn those numbers on. I don't know what it was. Now it's gone. Okay, we're good. Uh, how do we get rid of this metal? London, 25. So they kind of like us. Not really still neutral, but transactions. Cooperation, 18% chance. If we give them some metal, like, oh, 64 or 43. So 64. 26% chance for this to succeed. At least we know that uh, when we use the metal as a bribe bribery tool, it doesn't uh, get used up, I think, until they actually accept the offer. Let's see if this works. I really need to get rid of that metal. Authority is not growing for whatever reason, despite the fact of having a better administrator. So he didn't raid us this time. He's up to 98 power. Within six. Within two. That's particularly harsh for men and crops. Thank you. Growth in one. Still growth in one. Okay, keep that food going. Get some uh, infrastructure that's apparently not building up. The stockpile only count when there's excess of when the building is built. You can't stockpile ahead of time. If that's the case, there's no reason to keep those guys in there. We might as well stockpile on the food. Let that go faster. New person. I'm sorry, new population. So, what are our choices? Flax. A wise woman hut. Bonus from herbs and drugs and herbs. Do we have drugs and herbs? I don't even know where we got the drugs and herbs from. Small harbor. Better trade. We have wood production here. Miner stockpile. Let's do the harbor. So we'll have better trading in the future. Okay, so two turns to get that done. Okay, let's see what uh, hopefully England responds positively to our little request. Mainly just to get rid of our metal. Because <laughs> apparently we have too much. Store at most 60 bundles of ingots uh, fit for a weapon in our making. It's still not going. Why isn't our authority not going up?
And then they have signed a trade deal. Yay. And our metal has disappeared. But they like us now, right? Better? 25. A noble of questionable lineage from Munster audaciously puts a claim on Southern Neil, leveraging distant ancestral ties to challenge our authority. That's a total lie. You have received a new regional decision, Forced March. Forced March does. Increased by... Will increase by two movement points to speed all home units in the region. Achieving surprise is half the victory. Population growth. I don't get to make claims on these guys. I haven't received anything to allow me to make claims. So I'm doing something wrong. Oh! I think I noticed. I'm supposed to be... Diplomacy. You guys. Insult an emissary. Insult their emissary. Perhaps humiliate them. In the most extreme case, kill one or two of their envoys. The end result will be the same. This will anger them and please their enemies. If you have no claim in their territory, you might get one, although it can cost some authority. Who cares at this point? Most recent diplomatic mission to Munster can cast doubt on the parentage of their ruler. He's got parents? Okay, so, capital. I'm going to work on some military stuff. Oops. What's this? Spearmaker. Spearmakers assemble and store a variety of light to medium weaponry. Spearmakers will efficiently and specifically improve your spearmen levy units, converting their raw version to a more experimented one. As with the other buildings improving units, you don't need to actually station the unit in the region. Being within your nation as in supply is sufficient. Looking Oh, another manor. Do we need a do we need a manor where we our capital is? I mean, we have a king's residence. I don't think we need one of those. Spears, it is. Current stockpile one plus twenty per ten infrastructure upkeep. Blah blah. Okay. So, off me three turns. Two turns. Two turns. Okay, then. More food. Small harbor next turn. Yeah, it's growth in one turn, and then you. Growth in five, no buildings. But again, we have horses now. Is that for trade? It is. But we're not trading it. Yeah, we're not trading it. Lock. This is what we're importing. This is stuff that we can trade. So we're just trading to preserve goods and timber. It's not negative three overall. Negative ten. What's eleven here? Because legumes, leather, stone. Uh, it livestock. Trading almost everything except that grain. I don't know why I heard digging sounds there. Just heard digging sounds. I'm not sure why. <laughs> because they're building something? Maybe that's why? I don't know. Anyway. Um... 
So anyway, we're in good standing with uh, England, which is good, right? We've got a nice little treaty with them, trade. Oh, you can only trade by land. Ports. Do we have? We don't have an agreement with these guys. Castle Town. Southern Uplands. Yeah, we don't have an agreement with them, I don't think. Operation. 10% chance. Um, we'll ask. See what happens. The worst that can happen is they'll say no. Now, you guys. Do you like us? Negative six. Let's make them more friendly. Oh, we're still canceling their emissary. Why that came up, I don't know. You're up to 57. Are we up to 60 at some point? Yeah. Uh, Tamarius, Tamarius uh, Thomas has boldly insulted Brian, ruler of Munster, accusing him of lacking both courage and wisdom. How's that going for them? Negative 16. So we're trying to broke them into a war. I'm not sure if it'll work that way, but... We can continue to insult them, though. Your observations about the crass stupidity of the ruler of Munster, while possibly true, <laughs> have not gone over well there. <laughs> okay. little combat. How come he's not getting strong rates? Because it's only six units, that's why it's not getting bigger. That's as big as his army's going to be for the time being. Meanwhile, we're up to 98. Uh, but we have to be at least uh, 128 plus that. So is that 163? It's a fairly large army for us that we can't afford. Oh, now our manpower is over. Our equipment production of 51 allows us to maintain at most 176 musters of men ready to take arms. So that's this area. Let's put them up here. Production of 51. So regional manpower is 21. Military upkeep minus 15. Equipment production 51. I think we have higher equipment production than that, don't we? We have way higher than 51. I don't know what that 51... I don't know where that number is coming from. No idea where that number is coming from. New population in Dublin. You guys are suggesting hemp fields. Stone mason, that'll help our infrastructure, but cost money. A fisherman house. This is a commercial thing. So food, three. Infrastructure, one. Money, three. Missing bonus of two. Food, three. Money from sales. Produces fish. Do we have fish here? We do have fish here. So we should probably do a fisherman house. Or a close settlement. Or a village green. So 
It's only there until 20 population, though, and we're currently at 6, 9, 11. Stone mason or fish? We use the nearby water to get fish, which is used by the coastal market and as a food source. It's really not a lot of stuff there. Ten turns to get three food and three money. Doesn't really seem like that's worth it. Oh, seizures is four, but... Stone mason. Um, we don't have any hemp production in our little empire here. It's just more equipment. Close settlement. Change fortification level. Structural provide fortification. Bonus to the region. Once uh, enough fortification points are accumulated, a new castle-like building will be available for construction. Uh, this is Dublin. Eh, it's only two turns. Still get to keep producing population five turns. Bite the plague has been removed as we've done too many decisions. And trader is twenty five re we get twenty five resources, whatever that means exactly. Life is pleasant in Southern Neil, and Craftsman lent a hand to speed up the ongoing construction. Eight infrastructure points added. I don't think we really needed that. That was only a two-turn thing for a spear maker. Small harbor. Oh, small harbor is already done. So small harbor gets us money, and the wood gets turned into ships, transport ships. Value seven. Our money's up to fourteen. But it was this has always been producing good stuff anyway. Manufactured by Small Harbor One. Complete list of structures using it as a bonus. Ferry, trade emporium, emporium, all that stuff. I'm not sure how these things... I mean, they tell you you need to have the the wood in order to build the ships, the transport ships, but they don't. you don't actually build the transport ships because they don't show up here. Because I don't think... Because these are just... This is a warship of some kind. It's better than the actual galley, but... Its effectiveness is better. If I and power generation, so our equipment production 51 allows us to maintain that most 176. I don't know where that 51 is coming from though, because it's not here. Because this is, uh, we have 23 in stockpile, reducing 39. That's not 51. 
13 plus 39. That's not 51. Is it? No, that's 12. Yeah, it's 50. I can add. It's 52. So, yeah, our total equipment is way over 51, so I don't know where they're getting the 51 from. It doesn't tell us here. Rounding error? That's a big rounding error. Welcome back, T5. The powers of resource glow people, blah, blah, blah. If you go above your maximum, mostly determined by your overall military equipment production, 25% of the extra will be lost each term. So if you go over your max, mostly determined by your overall military equipment production. But our, this is our military equipment. It's, that's eight. So base from production is eight. Base from structure is 14. Overall regional equipment production is 22. See, that one's eight. That one's 22, so that's 30 right there. That's 43. And that is 82. <laughs> that's a big rounding error from from 82 to 51. That's a big rounding error. Seventy five percent of that is 60. And it's still. 25% of the extra will be lost each turn. So how do I get rid of it then? I mean, it's, a being, it's being lost. I mean, it's not a big deal. It's not, it's not a negative number for us. We still have 150, but can we, can we trade? We can't trade that stuff, right? Hello, Gimpy. It is time to take a break. What? Go get some more water while you are up. Your next break is in one hour. Okay, just make sure it's uh, building stuff. Building stuff stuff. Okay, so I'll take a break, get up, stretch my legs, and try to figure out. That's one hell of a rounding error. And uh, anyway, be back in a few minutes. Thank you all very much for watching. Enjoy the dog video.